Finding objects in a cluttered physical space can be challenging. Consider trying to locate an important piece of paper on a cluttered office desk. As interactive tabletop displays become more common and adopted in the workplace, a related occlusion problem will occur. Physical objects that are placed on the tabletop surface can hide graphical objects drawn on the display. However, current tabletop technology allows for detecting physical objects resting on the display. In this work, we propose utilizing this information to mitigate the occlusion problem within virtual and physical objects. We evaluate six different occlusion management techniques for this purpose. The first one, glow, adds a glowing outline around any physical object that is occluding a virtual one. This gives a non-intrusive indication that a potentially important part of the display is hidden. Icon, on the other hand, takes this a step further by showing a miniature version of the hidden object at the nearest edge of the physical object. The piling technique forms a pile of all virtual objects that are occluded by a particular physical object under that physical object. This is done by placing miniature versions of the virtual objects so that their edges stick out. Minimap adds a miniature overview of the whole virtual space where the footprints of all physical occluders are shown as well as any underlying virtual objects they occlude. The move technique simply moves any occluded virtual object to the nearest edge of its occluder. Finally, Replicate takes a more drastic approach by copying the full occluded virtual space and displacing it to an unoccluded area of the screen. We perform two user studies to evaluate the characteristics of these techniques under different spatial arrangements, levels of occlusion, and object densities. The first study measures user performance for unguided visual search. Participants were asked to search the visual space for an abstract target occluded by simulated physical occluders, and their time performance was measured for different occlusion management techniques. The second study was on guided visual search and asked participants to memorize the locations of a sequence of five photographs in an initial learning phase. In a recall phase immediately following this, simulated occluders were added to the space and participants were asked to revisit the photographs in the same order using the different occlusion management techniques.